G'day Steel Nation Australia, G'day Steel Nation Worldwide, and G'day Steel Nation Universe. But in today's video, should I really be saying G'day Steel Nation Australia? Because, look, my channel is named Steel Nation Australia because I'm an Australian watching football, watching the Steelers in Australia. But today, guys, I want to talk about uh, five reasons why Australians in this, in this land, if this land of down under, do not watch the NFL. There are five reasons why. And I just made a quick list and I was like thinking of this stuff and I was like, it's the off season. I really want to rant again because, you know, the, the Mike Tomlin stuff was was last video. Go check that out and why I think he, he is a winner and why I think if he goes 4-0, it's time for the Mike Tomlin haters to shut up. However, that video aside, let's talk about uh, five reasons why that Australians don't watch the game. Number one, the number one reason I think that, that uh, the Australians don't watch the game is the NFL game is too long. So when you think about it, the NFL uh, goes over four quarters, 15 minutes a quarter, you know, for the first half, first first quarter, second quarter, then half a half, half goes about, you know, half time goes about half an hour or so, or maybe 25 minutes, third quarter, fourth quarter, the game goes too long, which I kind of understand a little bit. I do a little bit, but uh, when I watch the game, when I watch American football, when I watch the Steelers play, I get in almost this like this Zen mode, this chill out mode where I'm just trying to relax and watch my team play and hopefully win the game. So the game does go for about three hours, but in contrast to other games like rugby league, AFL, they go for about an hour, an hour and uh, you know, 20 minutes or 30 minutes anyway. So it's not like it's it's not like it's so long that you can't physically sit there and watch it. You can always break it up too if you have like game pass or something like that. You can break it up where you 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 get rid of the ads. You watch it on replay. I would never do that because I want to watch my. I don't want to watch on replay. But that is the number one reason, guys, that Australians don't like watching the NFL. It's because the game goes too long. Now, a side part to that to that to that argument, uh, stoppages. All right, stoppages. In the in the NFL, there are so many stoppages when you throw the football and it's incomplete. When there's a flag, uh, for some reason, Australians can't handle that. They can't handle. A few moments where, where a flag comes up <clears throat> and there's a stoppage. They just can't handle it. So that is another part where the game goes extremely long. Uh, part number two. So so reason number two why Australians can't or don't watch the NFL. I've heard this throughout my entire schooling career. Uh, when I was growing up watching the game, I was a big fan of American football when I was little. And all my friends would say, oh, no, this is not my, oh, my, oh, my. the players are too soft. That's what they would say. The players are far too soft because they wear padding. However, I don't think I don't think you want to call Brian Dawkins soft. I don't think you want to call Ed Reed soft. Mean Joe Green, Troy Polamu, uh, Ray Rice, even one of our rivals, soft. Right? I don't think you want to call any of these dudes soft. Derrick Henry soft because they wear padding. I really don't understand that argument. I think that's I think that's a very weak argument to say. Uh, the reason why I don't like watching the game is because the players are soft. You know, you better go out there and not wear pads and tackle like a real man. If you've ever seen an American football play, which you guys have, right, right, that these players send themselves at the other player. And also in the, in the trenches, they are locking horns like rams. They are not soft because they're wearing padding. They're tackling as hard as they can. And like I said to you, like, imagine James, imagine calling James Debo Harrison soft. So that point is null and, vo and void. No, number two is out of the works. Now, number three. So reason number three that the, the Australians do not watch American football, and probably like what, maybe one of the biggest reasons, it's really not in our culture. So when we grow up uh, as, a, as a young tucker, we're growing up watching NRL, AFL, we're playing cricket, we're playing, you know, sometimes we play basketball, we play tennis. It's really not in our culture to, you know, link up with a, we, we do have clubs in Australia. We have American football clubs here. Um, but it's not in our culture to be like, hey, mate, you know, little Johnny, go and play American football when you're this when you're this tall and you get higher, right? It's not in our culture. So that is another one thing that American football, it truly is American football. It's in your guys' culture. You grow up watching the game. You grow up with your your dad in the backyard, throwing the picks in, catching the football. You also grow up with your your friends and your friends when you're little, when you're little kids running around the neighborhood, seven on seven, three on three, NFL street style. It's kind of cool like that. So it's just not in our culture. It's not in Australian's uh, culture to go out there and pick up the, the the pigskin, throw the football around. Yes, we do it at the beach, but it is quite comical. If you've ever seen Australians try to throw American football, it's really hard. Like, I'm not the best, but I, but I used to be okay at it. I used to be okay. Maybe I could throw 20, 30 yards. 
But uh, the, some some of the some of the the Australians out there I see on the local holidays, like Australia Day, throwing the American football is like a duck egg. You throw it and it spins like backwards. So that's number three. Number four. Uh, here's here's an interesting point, right? Number four. They will wear so Australians will wear the jersey. Australians will wear NFL jerseys. They will wear Steeler jerseys, Raider jerseys, Patriots jerseys, Jets, whoever, Giants, uh, Commanders, uh, you name any team, Chiefs, whoever you want. Who else have I named? Dolphins, Green Bay Packers. They will wear the jersey and the player name on their back, but they'll have no idea where they're from. No idea. I've had countless, countless uh, conversations growing up being an NFL fan and talking to someone at the bar one of my friends at a local park or friends that uh out there you know when i'm out there playing tennis or whatever i had a conversation with them and i'm like oh mate you've got troy's jersey how good is troy and the other bloke would be like i don't know what you're talking about i don't know who, i don't know who the guy is i have no idea i just i like the colors i just like the jersey you know and that's why i became a fan i like the colors still like i don't know who it is a few weeks ago i ran into a patriots guy i said mate how how do you think the patriots go this year I don't know who the Patriots are. I just like I like the I like the color. I like the jersey. I think it's cool. And I was like, man, you talk to any Raider fan here on the Central Coast where I'm from, they have no idea about Al Davis. They have no idea about John Madden. Zero idea. So we have the the jerseys in Australia. Uh, Australians buy them, but they don't know who the team is. They're not barrack for them. They're not support them. They're not they're not cheer them on in any point. So that's number four. They buy the jersey, but they don't know who they are. And it's I've I've almost I've, I'm slowly giving up to be like, if I see a Harrison jersey out there, number ninety two, do I go and talk to that guy, or is he just wearing it? Do if I see someone wearing Tom Brady, do I ask him if he's a Patriot, uh, Patriot fan or a Bucks fan? Do I see, if I see a guy wearing Patrick Mahomes? Nah, I've almost given up. Okay. Number five, and the, probably the biggest point, really, number, the, my, my fifth reason why Australians, uh, um, you know, don't like the NFL. It's because they don't understand the NFL, right? And there's a few reasons why. Australians do not understand the game. I've almost had so many countless times I've been to the bar or being surrounded by people watching the NFL in whatever scenario, friends, family, this and this. They do not understand the the uh i guess the, it's pretty simple to me it's f you get four first downs if you don't make the first three you're pretty much going to kick it on fourth down punt it away for for position or you're going to go for it and, and turn the ball over they do not understand the actual down concept where you get first down second down third down and fourth down that is one of the biggest things why australians don't watch the game is the down concept so us who know football, I've been watching for 21 years now, 20 so years. It's first down, second down, third down. If you do not get that extra downs and move the sticks, there's a point where you need to choose. Do you go for it? Do you risk it? Or do you punt the ball away and live another day? The, the, the most common phrase I hear is, when will your team get the ball? And it could be whenever. It could be never. So... <laughs> Australians do not understand the game. And it's not really like it's not really overall their, their fault because it's not it's not now culture to go out and watch the game. Yes, it, it's it's slowly getting bigger here. Slowly getting bigger. But it is quite comical to hear these things of like, why did he do that? That should be a try. That should be um, you know, um, you know, the, the football gets thrown into the ground for an incomplete. We all know the clock stops. And then somebody will say, why did the clock stop? Like the, the hardest, one of the most difficult points and why I don't do it anymore is watching the Super Bowl um, surrounded by Australians. If I watch the Super Bowl surrounded by Australians, it is like one of the worst times ever because you're consistently just explaining the game to, to newbies and it's really frustrating. So the number fifth reason why um, Australians don't like the NFL is because they just don't get it. They just don't understand the game and also, a lot of them aren't willing to learn. You know, they're not willing to, to take a few hours to um, to learn about the game and really dive in and, 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 and see what masterpiece it is. The reason why I love it is because it's, it's pretty much how I see it. It's my best person against your weakest player. How can I exploit your weakest player? 
how can I get the uh, you know the slot or, or the, the the outside receiver on your weakest player? How do I get their our offensive line pushing the defensive line backwards? Where can we find a weakness on the defensive line? Push that backwards and run the football down their throat and set up a pass, set up play action. That's why I love it. But Australians who don't like the NFL just don't understand the game, and it is really frustrating to to explain. Uh, to explain the game over and over and over to people when you're watching the Super Bowl, when they just have no idea, and you'll you'll be sitting there with like two minutes and and and, and forty seconds to go, fourth quarter, uh, Steelers are up by seven points, and they will be saying, "When do you get the ball back? When do you get the ball back?" And you're like, "Well, it depends. It depends when you get the ball back. Why is why isn't the, why is not the why isn't the clock moving? Well, it all depends. So." Yeah, hope you guys like that uh, rendition of Australians not liking the NFL because it, to me, I love it. I love the NFL. I really do. I absolutely love the NFL. It's so much fun to watch. So there are five reasons why. The game is too long. The players are soft. Uh, it's not in that culture. They wear the jersey but don't, don't understand who the player is. And Aussies just don't understand the game. They don't understand the game of gridiron. Okay, guys, I'll see you later. Here we go, Steelers. Here we go.